Greetings, 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 my sports to the bone people. Welcome back to the channel. Thank you all for tuning in. Hope everybody is doing all right. Hope you are enjoying your Sunday evening. Now, this video is totally different from what I originally wanted to make. But guess what? Rain, 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 pan top of rain and more rain. Yes, my viewers and subscribers, it's a no result in that fifth and final T20 game between West Indies and England. You know, only five overs, they managed to get only five overs in. You know, West Indies, we were batting at the time. Evan Lewis and she hope they were teeing off, you know, before the rain came. We'll talk about that a little bit. Plus, we'll take a look at the two-day warm-up game that is going on between the West Indies Select 11 and Bangladesh. Yes, we actually got a day's play today. Bangladesh batting first and scoring 253 for 7. And then West Indies, the Select 11, got an opportunity to go out there. So we're going to take a look at that, right? Give a listening ear until the end and let me know what you all think in the comment section. Also, please remember to subscribe to the channel if you have not yet subscribed. All right, so before I give you what Captain Craig Brathwaite and his West and his um team what they what, what they are currently going on with, let me just go through this um final T20 game here. So the West Indies team, we lost the toss. And once again, we were asked to bat. You understand? We were doing pretty well, you know. We were 44 for 5. And, you know, one over. Um, we had one over remaining in the power play. Um, Evan Lewis was looking real good. You understand? He basically took over um, where She Hope left yesterday. Remember, out of the blocks, She Hope was an aggressive one. So tonight... Um, Evan Lewis was being the aggressive one until the rain came, right? So we finished and we were 44 for um, 44 without loss after five overs. Evan Lewis he was on 29 from 20 with three fours and two sixes, going at a strike rate of 145. She Hope he was on 14 from 10 with um, three fours, yes, 14 from 10 with um, three fours. You know, strike rate of 140. So that's basically how it was looking. And the plane 11 that they had decided to go with, you know, those two guys plus Nicholas Poor and Ravman Paul, Rastan Chase, Hetmeyer, Rutherford, Shepard, Moti, Hussein, and Azari Joseph. So Romaro Shepard coming back in place of Obed Mackay. But, you know, unfortunately, as I said, you know, they had to, the game was abandoned because of the rain. So that is how that went, my people. We will have another video to look at the series in general, you know, just to cover certain little things. But just wanted to give you an update on that. All right. Now, the West Indies Select 11, they are currently going up against Bang the Bangladesh team. Well, I say currently, you know, they are, they are on the night's break for tonight, right? Um, Bangladesh, they batted first and they scored 253 for seven. Yes, 253 for seven of 73.2 overs west indies we were uh we were um we were only needed to face two overs right we only faced two overs prior to the end of the day and our captain he was unable to um to, to last those two overs he was removed without scoring right so captain craig brathwaite was removed um faced four deliveries and then was removed so i will tell you who who else we have at the crease but let me just give you this um, batting from Bangladesh, right? Just in case you're familiar with some of the names, you know, they have quite a few talented players that, you know, they are involved in ODIs and T20s also, not only tests. So you might be familiar with some of the names. So the captain, um, Mehedi Hassan, he made 11, right? Didn't do much. But the guys that did the, the, the majority of the work in the uh, middle order, we saw um, Islam, uh, Hisan, um Islam, he made 41 from 87, right, with four fours and one six. So, you know, Islam doing some work there. Jaker Ali, he made 48 of 110 deliveries and he had four fours and one six in that knock. Linton Das, who is a very talented white ball player, 
you understand he retired um not out hurt and 31 of uh, 53 four fours and one six in that knock so you understand um that is basically how um the guys that did majority of the work um for bangladesh now bowling for the west indies select 11 jair McAllister he bowled 9.2 overs one maiden and he picked up two wickets yes two wickets for 48 runs um we also saw sharon lewis he bowled seven overs 24 runs one wicket one maiden nathan edwards bowled 12 overs two maidens 35 runs one wicket we also saw justin greaves um bowling eight overs uh he picked up one wicket for 20 runs with one maiden um shame holder got two for 48 of 17 overs with three maidens um so those were the guys there that did the work for us with the ball right so you know um 273 um 253 for seven of 73.2 overs now as i said <laughs> when it was our turn to bat um craig brathwaite was removed um you know he made uh, he didn't score any at all so really really tough my people we don't we don't have a lot of fun memories from the last time we played um a test you know with we, 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 where our skipper is concerned you know so hopefully um hopefully hopefully we'll find some form when the series starts um kimani milinius um kimani milius he's there on three from three right and dorn um you know dorn is also there on two from five um joshua dorn so those are the guys there Jerry McAllister, Tevin Imlak, Shame Ola, Jordan Johnson, Daniel Bickford, Justin Greaves, and a couple others, you know, um, they are still there to come. We're not sure um, how many people will get an opportunity to bat because remember, it finishes, it's, it's going to be over tomorrow and it's a warm up game. So I guess they can do it whichever way they want. But yeah, that is pretty much how that is going. Um, by the end of tomorrow, I will de definitely give you an update as it relates to how you know the batting would have would have would have done. You understand? Hopefully they can bat out the entire day. You know, a couple of talented players here, guys like Kimani Milios, you know, very talented. Tevin Imlak, who has been um in and around the West Indies test squad for a little while now. You understand? Guys like Jordan Johnson, you know, um he, he showed some good uh he showed good potential during the, his under 19 time so you know we're hoping that he will be able to get some runs here and um we'll we'll, we'll start building something uh nikita miller i think nikita miller is the man that is leading them in this you know to get some experience as a coach but yeah that is pretty much it for your late night update I'm gonna leave it right here for now big up on yourself stay safe